Hello everybody, it is Mr. Modern Financials here coming at you with another video. Before we get started, I'm going to ask a quick favor. If the topics of making money online, making money from home, passive income, earning money with apps, if any of that is of interest to you, be sure to subscribe to this channel. That is all we talk about here on this channel, making side income, making more money without working a nine to five job. That is what we do here on this channel. Now let's get into this review. Today I'm talking about Lula Rides. Now I got informed about this app through a Facebook ad uh, probably a, about a week ago. I put it on my phone, I installed it, I signed up. I am no longer a college student, but I remember when I was, this app could have been a bit useful for me. Um, and I wanted to put this video out there for our college students, for people struggling with money, um, and just kind of talk about Lula and if you could actually earn money with it. And you might be asking, well, how did how would you know? You haven't used it yet. Well, I did a ton of research on it. I looked through all the internet. I scoured the internet, scoured Reddit forums, so I could give an unbiased review. And what I have found is mostly positive. There were a few disgruntled people out there, but the majority of the reviews of Lula were positive. I looked on Reddit, a couple other places, Twitter, whatever, and I finally came to an answer that it actually seems like a decent option. Now, one awesome thing about if you're doing the renting, no underage fees. Now, if I wanted to rent a car, I'm still under 25, so I'm going to be paying a lot under normal conditions, but with Lula, I could actually save some money. Now, you could earn thousands of dollars every month. That is why I titled this video that way. You could earn a lot of money every month if you do it right. And your car is completely insured, all right? This is 100% insured, and I haven't found any issues with the insurance online when I was doing my research. Now, this is going to be found on over 200 college campuses across the world, and if you are at a college, you could contact their... Um, Leader, Matthew, you see their email right there, and I was actually on the app itself, and I'm currently in LA, and there's actually a lot of people around here using it. I was ple pleasantly surprised, because if you look at the website and you can see that they have their uh, contact information right there, this at first glance looks like a startup. This looks like a relatively new business. Um, a small company app. It's not an Uber. It's not as big as Lyft, and it's different than those services, of course. But I'm just talking about size. It's not a huge company right now, and um, that's me being completely honest of how I look at it. Now, one thing I did kind of wish were the case with Lula is I think they should expand this to be past. You know, not only colleges. I think Lula could be a great thing for a lot of different people. And I don't, I think they're doing a disservice by only allowing college students to do this. All right. So I am, you know, I like Lula because I did my research on it. I think it's a good option if you're trying to earn a couple thousand dollars extra a month. Of course, you're going to be giving away an asset. But I also do think that, you know, expand this. And I hope they do eventually expand it. Now, one thing I wanted to talk about with the earnings, you have to remember, if you're renting your car, you have to calculate costs. You cannot just rent your car out, you know, 24 seven, make a thousand bucks a month. Oh, I made a thousand dollars a month. No, you have to calculate mileage because using your car results in depreciation. It's the same thing if you're an Uber driver. If you're an Uber driver and you're not calculating your costs, you're doing it wrong because those costs are actually also tax deductible, meaning when you drive your car, you depreciate its value, it puts wear and tear, it increases the amount of repairs. You can deduct that on your taxes, which basically means the government doesn't take that money. It's kind of um, it doesn't make it free, but it makes it a little bit less of an issue. So when you're renting with Lula, if you're going to, if you're a college student and you're going to rent with Lula, please, please, please make sure that you are calculating your costs because if not, you're not going to have an accurate view of how much you're making. Um, I think it's very possible to make $800, $900 a month doing this if you let your car do it full time because the prices are quite decent. However, I don't think this is going to be a career job. This is kind of a thing that will get you through college. Another interesting thing I wanted to mention is the idea of who pays for the gas. Renters are responsible to fill up the gas when they are used, and if not, they will face a $25 
fine. So renters are going to fill up your gas. So you don't have to calculate your gas. Unlike Uber or Lyft, you do not have to calculate your gas, which is good, which is really good. You go to which cars qualify. Your car has to have less than 125,000 miles and is newer than 2,000. Those aren't horrible restrictions. I mean, my car, I don't drive a fancy car. I'm just like you. I'm, I am not driving a Mercedes around. I drive a Hyundai, has about 95,000 miles. So I would be able to be eligible for this service if I was a college student. And a couple years ago, I was a college student. So definitely consider Lula. If you do end up signing up, you have to use my link in the description. If you use my link, you actually will get a bonus. So be sure to use my link in the description. Get yourself a bonus. Don't miss out on some extra cash. Sign up at the very least. And if you end up actually going forth with this, let me know how it goes. I genuinely want to do another review of this service in the future. This is not my final review on this. I want to see how this plays out and how the company handles everything. So let me know in the comment section if you have used it or if you're going to use it and be sure to use my link. And that's it for this video. It's Mr. Modern Financials here and I will catch you next time. Have a great day. Inbox Dollars allows you to earn extra money doing paid surveys in your spare time. Use my link below in the description and you will earn a $5 bonus for sign up. Do not miss out and be sure to use my link.